Hey everybody, this is Jennifer with Giddy Gen Plants. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another Mini Monday. If you would like to see a very chatty video featuring the week of the 21st through the 27th of October, then just keep on watching. Okay guys, so first of all, hello, welcome back. If you are subscribed to my channel and you didn't leave my channel that whole week, I decided to take a break, then thank you guys so very much. I love you all of my heart. I really appreciate it. And if you are new to my channel, hello, I'm Jennifer with Giddy Gen Plans. I really hope that you guys will stick around. And so, wow, where do I begin? Um, it has been a very crazy week and I did not get anything filmed last week. And I realized I needed a break. I needed a break from all social media, which I am not up to date a lot on Instagram anymore anyways. This semester has really been a lot. I'm preparing for grad school. And in that preparation, I have to take the GRE. I have to stay on top of my grades. Um, I've just got a lot to do. And it's setting in that um, I was told yesterday, in fact, that even though the due date is February is in February to apply for grad school it's best to go ahead and apply as soon as possible like December that way if there's things that they need they can get back to me and it's like oh okay well it's October that's really close and I am not ready guys I am so not ready every time I get ready to like study for the GRE something else pops up we've got two tests or we've got three papers or we've got a big research paper or blah 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 my life has been very crazy and my mom was like you've got to prioritize like maybe not do extracurricular activities um like you know teaching the teen class at church which i i am try to be superwoman i try to do it all so i have not gotten rid of anything um but i did decide to take a break from youtube for a week and it was definitely what i needed um i'm ready to get back into it but I'm not really sure if I'll be able to continue with posting videos Monday through Friday because that is getting to be a lot with my schedule. Now once school is out, heck yeah, I'll go back to posting, you know, every single day. Um, I just think I might need to back it off a little bit. Of course, I've already got videos planned for today, tomorrow, Wednesday, and the rest of the week. But anyways, it's if I get a, like a chance to edit. Editing is like the hardest part. Because I end up saying stupid stuff and I have to take it out. I'm like, why did you say that? That made no sense. Anyway, so today I am not only going to do a plan with me for the week of the 21st through the 27th in my Girl Gang Planner. I wanted to go ahead and show you. Um, I set up my October uh, month for this uh, Wrong Wrong Fierce and Fabulous mini planner and I have not shown that off yet. I decided to do that off camera last week. Just I needed some planning time but I didn't want to film if that makes any sense. Like planning to me is relaxing and I just needed just some quiet time. I just needed to plan. So I decided to do that um, off camera. And so today I'm going to go ahead and talk about that, show you guys what I did, and I'm going to make this a chatty video, um, but I am going to fast forward through the plan with me portion just because... I don't know I feel like that could get the video could get lengthy and I do have other videos to film today plus I've got a study so uh, I've got a lot to do guys so um yeah so before we get started definitely follow me on Instagram at giddy gen plans subscribe to my channel give this video a big thumbs up and click that notification bell that way you're notified each and every time that I do upload all right guys so without any further ado let's get started all right, so I think bef 
before we do the plan with me, I will go ahead and do the flip through of October in my Wrong Wrong uh, Fierce and Fabulous mini planner. And so, um, wow, it's like popping up. That's terrible. That's okay. I love it. Um, so yeah, so I decided to go ahead and decorate it using all wrong wrong stickers. Of course, I had to. I love it. Um, and there's really not much to it. Um, I kept my whole simplistic thing going. Um, but it's enough that I can jot things down, which I almost wrote some things down today. And I was like, well, wait film yourself and then you can write things down so everything is blank except for the checklist um, I have been keeping up with a checklist daily so there are things written on that but anyway so this is how the before the month page turned out and y'all know if you've been on my channel you know I can't ever think of the name of that so sorry um, but anyway so I just put this little pumpkin and this little kitty here and I think that's all I did is that a sticker? No. Nope. Yep, that's all I did, guys. Very easy. I did put a birthday down. And yeah, so that one's pretty simplistic. All right, and then for the monthly page, I love this. I love this washi tape down here. And this is washi from the Wrong Wrong Washi Tape. And so I put this Hello Pumpkin sticker. I put a little checklist. I love having checklists on my monthly view. I don't know why. It's just nice to have where you can jot things down. Um, if you don't have time to find the date or something. I don't know. I just love it. Um, and I put these two little stickers right here. I put the little pumpkin and, of course, the cute little gal. I love her hat. Um, and then I decided to go with like the kitty and pumpkin theme with the hearts. And so I just put a few stickers to do that. Of course, that's Halloween. So that is it for the monthly spread. And then whenever you get into the monthly portion of the, uh, or like instead of having, a, this is the monthly layout, so it doesn't have a weekly. So it has something that looks like this. You have an October uh, the or the month of October I do have habit trackers and I decided not to really use them right now um, I'm just so busy with life that, that I'm just I couldn't use those if I decide to though I'll go ahead and just mark where I'm at and, and continue but anyways um so I ended up putting some of the little hearts right there. That kitty was already there and that pumpkin was already there. So I kept with that theme by putting this sticker over here. I did uh, put some washi tape down. I put some pumpkins and then I love this. I put a slot, like a little piece of washi tape and then I put the Hello Spooky sticker. Uh, oh, I keep touching these because I can't remember if that was already there or if I put it there. But yeah, so that is how that turned out. And, oh, I also put that down. I thought that was really cute. Thankful for all my ghoul friends. I thought that was cute. All right. And then you get into the checklist. And like I said, you can tell that I've been making checklists. Um, these really help me. I love them. And I decided to use the orange um, highlighter because of Halloween. And I thought it kind of goes with the theme, even though it's like green and pink, like on here. I added all of the touches of orange just to kind of make Halloween pop. Well, they already had this over here, so it kind of worked out. And so I love how this looks, especially this, like having everything marked, like mapped out. I love that. Oh, it looks so cute like that, I think. I don't know. Something about a planner that is filled out just makes me so happy. All right, and then of course you do get a couple of notes pages uh, with these um, monthly layout planners. And I put this Halloween is here sticker, which is so cute. I put a pumpkin decorating and of course another little checklist. I put these remember stickers. I put all the stickers. So I keep saying I put this, that, that. All of these are stickers that I put because the note pages come just plain. And so I need to fill these out. But again, I wanted to wait until I showed you guys what it looks like. So there is the notes page. So that is it for the October setup in my mini wrong wrong fierce and fabulous happy planner. All right, guys. So I thought I would go ahead and show you um, last week's 
I didn't decorate because that was a week I didn't film but I wanted to at least write some things down so I wrote the basics and I mean it looks nice I tried to make it as neat as possible but uh, it feels weird without stickers but um, yeah you see how crazy my week was last week and that ain't even all of it I'm pretty sure I left out some things but that is okay so yeah so for this week uh, we'll be up. Uh, I'll be planning for the week of the 21st through the 27th and I can't believe next week is Halloween I'm not sure if whenever I edit I, if I'll have a new intro just for Halloween I'm thinking about going ahead and do that for this week and next week but I'm not sure yet um, and then I'll go back to my fall one for November um, but I am so inspired by these girls I think they are adorable so I almost went with squad the squad goals or squad life sticker book again but I do that a lot in this planner so I decided to go with the all in a season seasonal sticker book and if you can tell I have used a lot of this this is like a second one I have two of these and I don't even have any of these stickers left and so I'm just gonna work with what I have um, I am going to go ahead and fast forward on this part just because, like I said earlier, if I am talking, it could get very, very lengthy because it takes me a while sometimes to know where to put something. And so I did bring out a couple of different washi tapes. This one is kind of like a mustard yellowy. It's almost orange. Um, and it came from the Faith Warrior, uh, yeah, Faith Warrior washi tape pack. And then this one, I'm not really sure where it came from, but it's kind of that, almost that same color. Not, yeah, I guess they're, well, this one's a little bit more orange, um, but it's scallops and it's that real thin one. It's a Happy Planner, uh, yeah, it's a Happy Planner brand. I just don't remember where it came from. All right, guys, so I will set that, that to the side and I'll go ahead and tear out these pages and we will go ahead and get started on the plan with me. Here we go.
All right, everybody. So that is how it turned out for the week of the 21st to the 27th of October in my mini girl gang happy planner. And I really love using this all in a season seasonal sticker book. This is probably one of my favorites. I absolutely love this one. I have two of them and like all of the fall stickers in both are almost completely gone. Um, fall is my favorite time of year and so I tend to use a lot of fall stickers um, and so yeah but I really love how this turned out. I usually cover the little picture or phrase or whatever down here but it is so adorable I could not cover that up. Um, I wish I could like cut it out and use it somewhere else. I really like this. So cute like especially for next week because next week is Halloween. Um, I would love to use that on next week's but that is okay. Um, I love this sticker right here. I love the accents of the washi tape. Um, it's just kind of all over the place and normally I'm not all over the place but I really like the way that it turned out like that and so I'm really digging the vibes and I'm really digging how it looks and yeah I really love this spread. All right, everybody, so that is it for today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Do you have this sticker book, and are you madly in love with it like I am? And also, like I said earlier, those of you who are subscribed to me that didn't click unsubscribe during that week of no posting, I really do appreciate it. Um, I just needed that break, and I feel like it did me some good. And so, thank Thank you guys for understanding and again if you are new to this channel welcome i really hope that you enjoyed today's video definitely click that subscribe button and welcome to my channel so thank you guys so very much and i will see you all very very soon have a good day bye